got the throttle return spring on and that definitely wasn't a direct fit yeah I ended up uh, drilling holes bending shit so yeah it's on there though now it's working and I got the starter insulation on starter wrapped so it doesn't get it so hot that's done that turned out good and then the bad thing is was underneath here I think my son told me this but uh where is it yeah you're not I gotta go on the other side but anyways the you get out of here hang on a second get a picture of this this is not gonna be fun somehow I hit the stop record button so let's try this again so yeah I noticed underneath there when I was doing the starter I looked up there if you I'll try this again here yep yeah you can see the oop that didn't help come on baby oh that just won't focus on that spot but yeah if you look on it you can see the oil on top of the nut there for the oil line so yeah i gotta take that back off which means i'll have to take the z-rod off z-bar to get in there that's not gonna be fun but it's not the end of the world so small setback and let me show you what else i got done today hang on so anyways uh let's see here here we go a little dark in there but so i put this on here because the wiring needs to come over the top the wires for the spark plug wires and i gotta make sure it doesn't get into the linkage here so the wires all four come right over the top and then over the valve cover and around the other way the other thing I got done was I got that wire harness in there tucked in. I got one side buttoned in, but of course I go to the other side there and the head is different, so I gotta get a different Allen bolt to finish that up, so which will take about a whole minute. That won't be so bad. But that turned out pretty good. Should grab a big light. Let me get a big light. So can... Alright, I got the big light here. Now I'll show you what that looks like, that wire harness. So it comes from underneath there. And runs over to the other side of the motor. That was the harness that normally runs over the top. It's got that little uh, pocket, plastic pocket that runs across. So I like it. I just got to put that one uh, other uh, bolt in there. And the other thing I got done is I made a wire harness for the gauges. Oh, so much for that. Oop, you don't want to see me. There we go. So anyways, made this wire harness here for all the lights. That runs over the fuse box. So that turned out pretty good. 